Is it possible to really know if someone is a believer in Christ? John, the apostle of love, the disciple that Jesus loved, you know? John, he gave us, he wrote the, the, the fourth gospel. He wrote the epistles, um, first, second, and third John, and he penned Revelation, the book of Revelation. But I'm, I'm specifically talking about first John now, right? Where he's obviously pointing to Christ. He's obviously trying to encourage um, the um, the church there, the believers there to, you know, to abide in the apostolic teachings and stuff like that, that they were taught, you know, encouraging them, exhorting them, so on and so forth. He also was giving them a bunch of warnings. A whole bunch of warnings that I don't think they were overlooked, but I don't think that they are taken as seriously as they should. So what I'm gonna do is we're gonna go through First John, you know, text by text upon what I'm speaking of, which is the warnings especially when it comes to believers in Christ. So I'm gonna go through these different texts, right? Let's go. Starting at verse five, God is light and in him is no darkness at all. God is light and in him is no darkness at all. At all. Verse six, if we say we have fellowship with him while we walk in darkness, we lie and do not practice the truth. If we say we walk in, if, if we say we have fellowship with him while we walk in darkness, we lie and do not practice the truth. So that is verse five. C or first five B rather and verse six. Let's go to the next the next scripture. This is uh chapter two verse fifteen B. If anyone loves the world, the love of the Father is not in him. If anyone loves the world, the love of the Father is not in him very polarizing passage of scripture so this is chapter three and we're looking at verses four and verses six everyone who makes a practice of sinning practice key word practice that key word right there it's practice of sinning also practice lawlessness sin is lawlessness verse six no one who abides in him keeps on sinning no one who keeps on sinning has either seen him or known him peep game peep game so verse four whoever makes a practice of sinning practice lawlessness sin is lawlessness no one who abides in him this verse six no one who abides in him keeps on sinning no one who keeps on sinning has either seen him or known him this is god peep game it's john telling us something that we should really pay attention to let's go to the next passage this is verse eight whoever makes a practice of sinning is of the devil for the devil has been sinning from the beginning let's go back whoever makes a practice of sinning is of the devil this is john y'all the apostle of love whoever make a practice of sinning is of the devil 
point blank period for the devil has been sinning from the beginning now this is the, isn't talking about a mistake y'all the key word there is practice that is someone that is actively intentionally involved in sin not someone that makes a mistake you you, you sin here and you sin there practice okay let's not lose sight Whoever makes a practice of sinning is of the devil. For the devil has been sinning from the beginning. Let's look at the next text. We're looking at verses 9 and 10 in chapter 3. No one born of God makes a practice of sinning. Here we go again. Why is it that John is repeating himself? Maybe because he's repeating himself is because we need to pay attention to this no one born of god makes a practice of sinning he cannot excuse me keep on sinning because he has been born of god mm. verse 10 by this it is evidence who are the children of god and who are the children of the devil how are we missing this family how are we missing this this is chapter 5, verse 18. We know that everyone who has been born of God does not keep on sinning, but he who was born of God protects him and the evil one does not touch him. Hello, Deliverance Ministries. Mm. Eight different times. Eight different times. John addressed someone that is practicing sin. It's not of God. Someone that is practicing, making a practice of sin. It's not of God. And he t then turns to say, those that are born of God cannot keep sinning. That is making a practice. So John is telling us something here. Be like the noble Bereans who searched out the words to see if these things that an apostle that the apostle Paul was telling him was true. Search the scriptures daily. This is what we're supposed to do as believers in Christ. John tells us that those that do this are this. And he clearly says <laughs> that. By this we know those that are born of God and those that are the devil. Remember, family, on this page, we, we let the Bible preach and teach God's people. Book, chapter, and verse. Grace and peace.